Hello you guys and welcome back to another vlog. This is leveling, leveling Up with Tammy in all areas of our lives. That's right you guys, happy Wednesday to you. I hope that you guys are all doing well, feeling well, that your week has been a blessed one thus far. So as you can see, today we are going to be doing a vlog um, of decluttering my closet as y'all can see this closet needs to be reorganized clean I have so many pieces in here that I need to get rid of so I figure hey why not record a video of me decluttering my closet I have so many dresses so many pieces that I don't even wear anymore y'all and it's time to let it go this is just another part, another area in my life um, with being modest and just learning how to let some stuff go. Like, there's absolutely no reason, I'm just zooming y'all in a little bit, um, for me to hold on to pieces that I am clearly not using anymore. So yes, you guys, we will be decluttering this smaller closet of mine, y'all, and this is in the same room that i do a um, recording of a lot of my other videos and content and stuff so yeah we're going to declutter this closet bag up some stuff to prepare to take it over to um plato's closet to see if i can sell some stuff and yes you guys give y'all a quick outfit of the day this is what i had on all day working from home nice little comfy wide shirt that i got from target and i have on some just some cute little comfortable shorts, not too short. You know, just a cute little outfit of the day. This is what I look like all day working from home. And I have on one of my Timu um, necklaces, you guys, here that I showed you in my last Timu haul. So, yes, you guys, welcome back to the channel. If you are not yet subscribed, Go ahead, hit the subscribe button, turn on the bell notification so that every single time I post a video, a devotional, a day in my life, a vlog, whatever the case may be, you will not miss out on the notifications that we have a new video video up on the channel. Okay, you guys? So we're going to stop all the rambling. Like I said, y'all, today is a clean with me day, a declutter with me type of day, and I really need to try to get this closet situated so yeah as y'all can see i got all these purses up here this is a purse and then i just got all these things hold uh, hanging here clothes and i have shoes here on the shoe rack so i'm gonna take this purse out i'm just gonna hang it on the door there y'all this is a shoe rack that i have here um, not sure for sure if y'all can see that, but y'all half of these shoes, child, I'm not even wearing them, and that's that's pretty bad because I know I need to let some stuff go. But yep, so this is a shoe rack, you guys. Hope y'all can see that there. Need to let some stuff go, sis. Need to go through these shoes. I'm gonna have a pile where I'm gonna donate and a pile where I'm gonna keep, okay? All right, so these shoes, there's some random little socks there. So we're gonna pull that out. Got a boot that's stuck on there, y'all, boots. <sighs> this is my overflow closet, okay? All right, so my goal today is that I am gonna go through dresses that I, if I haven't worn it in the last two years, then it's time to let it go. It's not necessarily anything wrong with these dresses, but besides I don't wear them anymore, um, I'm tired of holding on to stuff that I'm not wearing and not using anymore. So it's time to let it go. So this is one of those pieces that it's time to let it go. It's just not my style anymore, y'all. Like I said, Nothing wrong with them besides some of them may be a little bit too short. And I am into the long dresses now. That's just my style. That's just what I like. So that's what we doing. All right. So, yep, yeah, just going to go through this closet and do what I need to do. 
got so many pieces that I need to let go. Like this dress, is nothing wrong with this dress, you guys. I like the dress, but I'm just not, I haven't worn it in the last two years. So, like I said, I'm not holding on to anything that I'm not wearing. If I'm not wearing it, then it's time to just let it go. And it is long, but it's just not my style. Not what I'm feeling, so I'm just going to go and let it go to someone that can use it. I also have that dress in black as well. Now, because this is a black dress, you never can go wrong with the black dress, so I will keep the black dress. Look at this, y'all. Still got the tags on it. I got this dress from Belts um, probably two summers ago. Or it may have been last summer, y'all. Never even worn it. If I don't wear it this year, I got to let this go too. All right. So that's what I'm going to do first. And for now, I'm just going to go through some pieces. I'm not going to do a lot of talking. I do have a little bit of music playing in the background. So y'all just going to see me declutter this closet, okay? white dress nothing wrong with it but i haven't worn it in a lot probably two three years time to let it go Can't just keep holding on to stuff just to hold on to stuff this is another dress you guys tag still on it never worn it i am gonna try to wear this dress though this is just a nice little casual dress I'm going to try to do a um, out, outfit of the day or a try on haul with this particular dress. So I won't be letting go of this one. Alright. Let's see. Ugh. Gotta get some organization in this closet. Ugh. This dress. Really cute, cute dress. I really liked this dress, you guys. But it's a little bit shorter than I would like for my taste now. So I'm going to let this dress go as well. Really, really cute. Hopefully, I'll get them sold at Play-Doh's Closet. Maybe they'll pick them up for me. This is just a rack of some skirts, some things. Let that go. This is one of my favorite little summer dresses. I will be keeping that. So that's my keep. This is a cute little blue skirt here. I'm going to see what I can do with making this skirt work. Try on video. Alright. So these are pieces that I'm going to work with and keep it's mainly my shorter dresses dresses that are just too short I, it I, I gotta let them go can't keep holding on to stuff okay um, let's see y'all got so many dress pants and slacks that I don't even wear anymore so, trying to let some of this stuff go. These were pants, some pants that I would wear like when I used to work out in the office, but now that I work from home, um, I really don't have need for all these pants and stuff anymore. So it's trying to, you know, like I said, let some stuff go. Um, here. Uh, gotta let it go, y'all. Some stuff just got to go. Keep. This is keep. I will keep like just my plain color pants because you never know when you night when I might need a pair of slacks just to throw on. Um, so I'm not gonna get rid of all of my slacks, but just some of them. All right. Um, but yeah, like I said, you guys, this is all a part of 
another area of being modest you know you got all these clothes in the closet clothes that you're not even wearing clothes that you have forgotten about y'all we got to learn how to let some stuff go it ain't no need to sit up in here being a whole hoarder we holding on to pieces just because we so scared to let it go no sis let that stuff go level up maybe your taste has changed um in the pieces that you have y'all i really like these pants these are really cute like little bell bottom type pants that i had gotten from new york and company back in the day y'all i really like these pants so again this is just sometimes when we have dress down sunday where you don't have to necessarily dress up and you just want to pound on a cute pair of slacks wild leg slacks with some heels or some boots in the winter time really really cute so i hold on to these like i said it's not a whole lot of the slacks that i'm gonna i try to keep the basic colors of my slacks but anything that's too extra and too many different colors or what have you then i just let that stuff go all right i love my blazer jackets um, some of them it's time to let it go it's just another pair of pants y'all this i actually this is these pants go to a suit jacket so i will be keeping these pants here and go here okay yeah, when was the last time you guys took the time to go through your closet and like declutter? This has been a long time coming. Been needed to do this, y'all. This is a really cute jacket. I love a um, nice little blazer, different um, type of jacket. You guys, I think I may have worn this one time. I low-key want to get rid of it, but I might try to make it work. If I don't wear it, by the end of the year, then I'm going to let this jacket go because I haven't worn it and I haven't, I'm just, like I said, I'm not going to be holding on to stuff just to, for the sake of holding on to it. If you're not wearing it, let it go, sis. Let it go. You got to let stuff go. There's no reason to keep this stuff. Now, this is a gray suit that I had from New York and Company a while ago but i don't wear this suit haven't probably worn this suit in the last five years so i'm gonna let this suit pantsuit go and it was just a gray casual pantsuit and i know it might be like girl that's great you can work with that but i don't wear it not my particular flavor so let it go like i said it says don't hold on to stuff this is another sports jacket haven't worn it last three to five let it go I'm trying to declutter this was a um black pantsuit now i will hold on to this one this was by ann ann klein suit jacket i had this for a long time but you know what i'm gonna let this go because most of the buttons and stuff have already fallen off got you know buttons on this side of the sleeve and then this side is no buttons stuff like this sis let it go there's no reason to hold on to it thinking oh i'm gonna wear it i'm gonna get to it no ma'am let it go another suit jacket this was from new york and company too i think i had um gotten a lot of new york and company sports jackets right before they closed we used to have one here in one of our local malls and when they closed out because i was really getting into sports jackets so I, I picked up a lot of sports jackets and to my demise i ain't really use them a lot so letting that one go to we making a we making a dent y'all and then this was a cute little black um suit skirt suit that i had this was the skirt kind of little flare out skirt and then it had the jacket to go to it but y'all again one of those that i have not worn forever i'm gonna let it go not my style anymore 
Like I said, I'm not going to hold on to stuff just to hold on to it. So, yeah. This is a blue suit. Again, this is a non-wear suit. I really like this suit. Linen pantsuit. So, I will be keeping this one. Yep. And this is another more winter um, sports jacket, y'all. I love this. is one of my favorite sports jackets. Kind of give you that preppy look with some jeans and some boots. Love this jacket. So, we're going to hold on to that jacket. So, as you guys can see, a little different sports jackets. This is another sports jacket, y'all. Love, 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 love this jacket. So, yep. So, I'm proud of myself. I got rid of some of them this is a cute little um this was again new york and company just a little sports jacket y'all i used to wear this with like some black jeans special football season this was black and gold pittsburgh Steelers colors that's our um football team in this household whoop, 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 whoop. Steelers, even though they ain't been doing that good but anyway so this is just a little jacket that i'll wear with some black jeans and one of my little Stiller's graph t-shirts I'll put on with this. So, yeah. I'll keep this one. Yep. So, and then this, you guys, is another pantsuit. Little spring pantsuit. I really like that suit. So, I'll be holding on to that one. Alright. So, y'all, I did make a dent in my, um, and these are just two, like, little blazer jackets a black one and a fuchsia pink one that i like to wear like i said i love sports jackets y'all love 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 sports jackets another thing that i want to do one day is to have all the same color hangers i don't know why i feel like the older that i get that's becoming a thing for me i can't it's like all the different color hangers and all of that it drives me nuts i rather have all one color I like to do things color coordinated, but for the sake of the video, we're just taking stuff out and I'm gonna go back and rearrange it when I'm all done. All right. Let's fix this hanger so they can all flow the same way. I need to clean these jackets, wash them. Some more light, I need to get me some more light. This was another um, blazer, y'all, that I like. Um, green and, and white spring jacket. Love this jacket. This is one of my favorite jackets, too. To wear. All right. So, all these white plastic, hang plastic hangers, y'all. Sharpening it. Just over it. All these straps hanging. Drop me okay all right so <sighs> y'all where am i gonna start at? oh my goodness all right and then this was another blazer love this y'all wait until wear this sometime really really soon but this is just a nice baby blue pinstripe jacket with the blue um linen pants y'all I am waiting to wear this, hopefully sometime really soon, definitely before the end of the summer. This is a nice spring summer um, outfit, and I will be wearing this soon. Soon, 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 soon. All right, y'all, so I got all my little dresses here. Some of my little dresses I have in the plastic. You know, little white dresses, what have you. I'm trying to I'm trying to keep them all somewhat together. Just to kind of protect them. I need to order me some, um, like, you know, like the suit bags. So that I can put certain items that you're trying to kind of keep from getting so dirty. Um, trying to keep them separated. So, anyway. <sighs> Y'all, my closet is so unorganized. This was a white hoodie, Nike hoodie that I had got last Christmas. Haven't worn it yet. But I definitely, Lord willing, will be wearing it 
this winter. Can't wait for winter to come so I can start to order my stuff. Um, let me see, y'all. Trying to see what else I need to uh, get rid of. This was a really cute dress too, y'all. But like I said, it's a little too short for me. I'm leveling up. I don't want, I, listen, I really want to let it go. Hold on, y'all. Cause this was cute with some boots. I'm gonna I'm give it one last try. If it don't work well, or if it's too short, but what I did is I wore, oh, I can still smell the perfume on this. I wore it with some leggings, like with some leggings up under with my boots in the winter time when it was cooler. Really, really nice um, fall color, y'all. You know what, I'm gonna keep it. And it got pockets on it too. Oh yeah, I'm gonna keep this dress. I'm not ready to let this one go yet, so we're gonna keep this one a little while longer. Okay, so. We got back. Y'all got so much stuff in here. These were some black slats. Another pair of black slats that I just had. <sighs> Y'all, I gotta get my life together. This is just crazy. I know what this is. This is a um, blazer that I had from a... Um, I had wore to a dinner party on my job. It's this blazer. I love this blazer too, y'all. As you can see by now, I love sports jackets. Love, love, love. But this was one of my favorite jackets, y'all, that I had wore. That crush velvet. Oh, y'all, I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. So that's what's in here. But I'm gonna put this over on the side. Over here. Trying to rearrange the closet, y'all. This video is not meant to be perfect, so we're decluttering, reorganizing, so yeah. Just letting y'all see a little bit of what I'm doing. All of my jackets. Trying to get this stuff situated. So this was just some of my random jackets and sweatsuits and stuff. I really need to just go through this stuff. This is sweaters, cardigans, and all that kind of stuff. I'm gonna have to take this out and I'm gonna place it over here for now. For now, so I can get it together because I just got too much stuff. Like I have, y'all. I've had these polo sweaters too for years. I mean, years. I like them, but I don't wear them enough. It's time to let it go. Like, I might keep this pink and green one though, because that's my favorite color. Pink and greeny, please. Pink and greeny, please. I had these sweaters forever. You know what, I might keep them, y'all. I'm gonna just put them over there for now. I don't know. Oh, all this, y'all, y'all see all this stuff <coughs> that I just got piled up in this closet. It ain't even making sense no more. So in my mind, this stuff need to make sense. Get, just, sis, do better. Get this stuff up. Cause this don't even make no sense. Have this closet. Got this much junk. Look at this. Empty Nike box. Inserts that was in boots. Ridiculous. Like, girl. Y'all. These were a pair of boots that I had. I bought these boots from Ross. I don't know how many years ago. Y'all, don't give me the line. I know I haven't worn these boots in at least five years. I have not worn these boots. Let it go, sis. We gotta let it go. I'm just holding on to stuff, like I said, for no reason. All right, y'all. Uh, 
still pulling stuff down, trying to make it make sense around here. As y'all can see, I got a lot of, I love cardigans and hoodies and stuff like that, especially in the winter fall. Because I, I'm, I'm like, can be a very cold natured person. And so I just like to be warm. So, yeah. This is another coat that I have had forever, y'all. Can't tell you the last time that I wore this coat. But it's got to go today. I like it. One of my favorite coats. But like I said, since I now work from home, I'm not wearing it. So, this will be going to Plato's Closet too. Gotta let it go. Gotta let it go. Alright. These white linen pants. I cannot fit these pants anymore. I should be able to fit these pants though, but girl. Oh no, they say they're size 12. I might try them. But the way my body been working. Oh no. Nah. White linen pants. No, we're gonna let them go. And then we're gonna go through all of that. was a white zip bag that I had. Uh, another white dress. Let it go. Alright, you guys. So, for the most part, as y'all can see, I got most of this stuff cleaned out. Uh, so now, I just need to put this stuff back, but neater of course make it as neat as i can so that's what i'm doing so i'm gonna just do this for a minute and let y'all watch okay all right so we'll Just kind of organizing my dresses now, how they need to flow. Reassemble this one here. We hang it. Um, I have a different hanger. Yeah, but y'all, it's just so important to make sure, I feel like when we are organized and we got ourselves together, you know, it just makes us feel better. I know it makes me feel good. I feel more level, leveled in my mind when everything is chaotic, such as as simple as my closet. It just, it, it, it throws me off because I'm like, Lord, clothes, stuff is just everywhere like out of sort out of order it just ain't even making no sense and i'm on this thing of i'm gonna need for this to make sense make it make sense because when things don't make sense i i i have a hard time and y'all done got my dress caught up in this hanger but yeah so this is why it's important to me that I take the time to reorganize this closet, reorganize whatever sis that you have going on in your life that is cluttered, whether it's your house, your room, something as simple as your closet. I'm going to go over here and get a different hanger. Y'all, we ought to be more organized than this. An organized life is a happy life. When your life is chaotic, it's cluttered, you got clothes everywhere, you got shoes everywhere, you just have stuff in the closet that you're not even wearing. 
we got to we got to let it go because I'm telling you holding on to junk to clutter just to hold on to it that is not the answer y'all I'm trying to tell you it's not the answer it's not the way to go it's not the way to be and we really have to let it go I'm telling you there's no reason to keep it no reason at all all my little jack dresses that I'm having in this plastic for them I'm just gonna kind of move those to the back because they're in plastic and they're covered so we're just gonna hang these dresses back here like so like that you know kind of get stuff out the way all right and yeah like y'all we have to do better it's like it's just no reason for our lives as women to be so chaotic so cluttered you don't know where nothing is we out here buying double um the same dresses it's not even why because our closets are so packed with clothes you don't even know what you got sis because you can't see it because you got so much stuff going on in your closet so i just encourage y'all to take the time to really declutter your life like really reassess you know what you have you know in your closets because holding on to stuff just having all this stuff for no reason mm -mm. we have to let it go we have to let it go in order for us to be able to move on to be more productive in life to be more successful in life we have to learn how to let things go i personally feel like that it is not it is not god's will or his plan for us to live a cluttered life you know when when our lives are so cluttered we don't pray we don't read our word we don't, you know, we don't fast. Our relationship with God is going to be cluttered too. Why? Because everything else around us is just cluttered. It's junky. It's janky. You, you don't know where anything is. And it bothers me. People that say, well, um, I focus better when stuff is just all over the place. And y'all, I'm telling you, that's my child. That girl, I don't understand why young girls keep such a nasty, junky room. <sighs> Burns me up. O-M-G. Like, that chick, she has no problem with keeping her room just cluttered and junky. I'm just like, sis, I really, I'm really gonna need for you to get it together. Y'all, I'm just kind of moving some stuff around off of my little clothing rack over there. Just moving some pieces around. Um, not sure that I want this white hoodie to be that dim. But just trying to make some things make sense in my world, in my closet. These pants, I'm going to hang them over here on my other clothing rack. Y'all, just because it just makes more sense to me. That's another thing. Learning how to use your space wisely. You know? You don't have to be so just all over the place with your clothes. And how you treat your stuff. You know? So, yeah. But I hope you guys are enjoying this declutter with me video like i said i have been thinking and thinking and thinking like i need to do something to get this closet organized y'all y'all this is one of those shirt long shirt dresses that i had ordered off of timu and i really need to record a video with this soon so y'all be on the lookout for that video coming for these other pieces that I have not covered yet um, with Timo. Anyway, so y'all now, I don't know if y'all can see me bending down here, but now, y'all, 
I got all these boots. Girl, I just got stuff everywhere. I'm keeping these boots. Um, so that was the clothes that I just went through. I need to put my other jackets back in here. I need to find, I might move those to my other bedroom closet, my jackets, my heavier jackets, just to kind of keep this closet from being so chaotic. But yeah, um, like I said, I really hope that this video is self-motivating for some of you to, you know, reassess, re reassess where you are, you know, reassess what you have going on in your life and declutter, you know, it don't have to be your closet. It can be other, other things, your car, your, your office, your home office, your purse, ladies, declutter that purse. It don't make no sense that we walking around here with all this junk in our purse. Like, come on, y'all. Level up. All these extra receipts for what, sis? Let it go. All these coupons and paper. Let it go. This is ridiculous. You ain't got to have all that stuff in your purse. You get to church. You get to the bank. You get to the grocery store. You standing in line. We fumbling through our purse because we got so much paper. So much junk in our purses. Like it's a diaper bag. Girl, level up, sis. Declutter that purse. Okay? Declutter the purses. Declutter the purse. Okay? We got the declutter. Y'all got about, let me see, one, two, three. I think I got four pair of long boots. Okay, put these to the back of the closet. And yes, I do wear these. I've worn all of these boots the last few winters. So I'll be keeping those. Um, have a couple pair of boots here. So just trying to organize these, y'all. <sighs> On. I love these shoes too, y'all. My little black little combat boots. Love these boots. I love boots and booties during the winter time. They're some of my favorite things to wear. So, yeah. Declutter your life, y'all. I promise y'all, y'all gonna feel better. You're gonna feel better, sis. Once we get it together, get it together, y'all. I done had these for a long time too. These snake skin boots. I ha I don't know. I probably wore these boots like really just a few times. If I don't wear these boots this fall, this winter, y'all, I promise I'm gonna let these boots go too because. They just been in my closet and we're leveling up, okay? Like I said, not keeping stuff just to keep it. Like, if you ain't wearing it, let it go, let it go. All right, so these are a pair of Calvin Klein booties, boot booty shoes that I have. These are things, y'all, that I used to wear when I worked in the office. I haven't worked in the office since the beginning of 2020. I have to let this stuff go. So these are going to Plato's Closet. Here we come. Plato's Closet. Yeah. Y'all, these are some shoes that I have had. Kenneth Cole shoes. I've had these shoes for a long time. But again, I ain't wearing them nowhere, girl. And I know me, as soon as I let these shoes go, then I'm gonna get this bright idea in my head. Oh, you can wear them shoes, girl. I ain't even got the shoes. That's the only thing about decluttering, y'all. You start decluttering and you start accidentally throwing stuff away and then you mad because you threw it away or you gave it away. But y'all, for real, for real, for real, I haven't worn these shoes. So I'm not even gonna, that's the other thing, y'all, with decluttering, as you can see. Your feelings and your emotions start to get attached to stuff. No. Let it go. 
they cute but i have not worn them in god knows when so we're gonna nicely let them go okay we're leveling up i also have a brown pair now i will keep the brown pair i feel like i will wear the brown pair before i wear the black pair so i will keep the brown pair y'all these shoes are so comfortable again these were kenneth cole um shoes let me zoom y'all in a little bit and like i said i've had these shoes for ever i think that's the furthest we can go y'all kenneth cole reaction shoes I've had them forever, long time. Nice, I've had these shoes for at least 10 plus years, y'all. I love these shoes. All right, nothing wrong with them. No chip, no peel, no nothing. So we're gonna be keeping these. And we will be wearing these ASAP, okay? Might even wear them church on Sunday, okay? All right, so these are just another pair of my booty boots. I love my booty boots, y'all, love my booties. So, put these back on the shelf. Um, let's see, what other shoes can I get rid of down here? Y'all, I got these shoes, black and white shoes, Calvin Klein. I think I got these shoes from Burlington Coat Factory. I have not, I haven't worn them, y'all. What I need to do as I'm on my journey of putting together a lookbook and some outfits. I got too many black pieces not to make this shoe work. I'm gonna hold on to these, y'all. We gonna make these shoes work in Jesus' name. Shram, shram. Brown pair of casual pair of just some brown coat shoes, y'all. I'm gonna keep these little shoes. These are just nice little slides, running errands. Like I said, as it get cooler again my little brown bag anything brown with some jeans whatever casual i'm not wearing my sandals open toe sandals i go to these shoes especially when the weather change to get a little cooler so yeah i'll be holding on to those um same for my little blue shoes crown ivory i think i got these shoes one year doing black friday from belts i think i wore these shoes one time but they getting ready to be worn this fall. Sure am. All right, y'all, so that's that. Again, another pair of black booties. Can't go wrong with your little booties, with your cardigans and your little jeans on, your little leggings. It's me, I'm all right. So that's that, y'all, for the closet. All right, let's tackle some of my purses here, y'all. Now, I love my purses. I am a coach girl. I am a, I love, 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 love my coach bags. All of my coach, now my purses, I have to admit, I, I, I use my purses. Got this little coach Snoopy bag from my husband last Christmas, y'all. And I have carried it, so... My, my purses, I will be holding on to those because I use my bags, uh, most of them anyway. I think the only one that I will donate or try to sell is this one. This was my first Dooney Burke bag, y'all. I had this bag for a long time. It's nothing wrong with the bag at all. I just have another Dooney Burke bag. Y'all know what? I'm saying I'm going to get rid of this bag, but I'm tripping. Girl, I'll be somewhere mad at myself. This was a Coach wallet that I've had for years. Y'all, one thing about Coach, if you take care of your purses and your bags, they're going to take care of you. So you know what? I got to put it in rotation. If I don't put it in rotation within the next the end by the end of this year then we're gonna let it go that's my promise to myself because like i said i'm tired of seeing all this stuff stuff just everywhere it's like ma'am no 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 I'm tired of looking at this um now i will let this bag go this was just a, a little crossbody 
sack bag that I had. Nothing too special about it. I think I had bought this bag from either TJ Maxx or Marshalls one year. It was just a crossbody bag. I think when I was on vacation and I just wanted something small, something that, you know, I could get away with that wasn't too bulky. So that goes in the donate bag. This is another coach bag, you guys, that I have. I got a little small coach bag and y'all, I love my coach bags. Every woman has her thing. I love shoes. I love bags. I probably, those are, I'll spend some money on a bag and I'll, I'll spend some money on some shoes. Like for real, for real. I can, I feel like if you got the right bag and the right pair of shoes, you can make just about any outfit look good. It's all about the accessories. Sis. So yeah. And then this is a really crossbody bag, coach bag. I'm about to go on vacation soon, um, me and my husband. And I think I may take this purse just because it's small, it's easy. I ain't got, you ain't, when you on vacation, honey, I don't have time to be doing a whole lot of fumbling, trying to figure out where is this, where I just need to look at my purse, grab what I need, and keep it moving, okay? So, yeah. So this is another little coach bag that I have. Like I told y'all, Coach, um, Coach, Dooney Burt. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I have, y'all. Another Coach bag. Black little simple bag. I haven't carried it enough. I need to get my life together and start playing. I might even take this bag. It's black, it's crossbody, it's easy, it's small. It's simple, easy to hold on to while you being a tourist in somebody else's town. You gotta worry about nobody robbing you. It's easy to put in front of me. I can hold on to it. I got it. Boom, boom, boom. So, coach bag. Plenty of space, pockets. I can put my cell phone, my wallet, what I need, and keep it moving. So, yeah, y'all. <laughs> I got another coach bag, y'all. Boom. Crossbody, might even take this. Y'all got so many options of bags that I can take with me on vacation. Like, sis, you are without excuse. But as you guys can see, I love, 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 love Coach. Coach is my purse of choice. I used to have Michael Kor bags, but mm, I ain't really no Michael Kor fan like that so yeah this is just what i have that was just an eyeglass case so yeah you guys um i have this now this i might let go this was a coach um backpack y'all it's nothing wrong with it i see i'm saying i might let it go girl you can use this for carry on on the plane, sis. Like, what is you doing? I could even use this bag as my, um, to travel with. You know, it's a backpack. Put it on your back and go on about your business. Like, so like that. I'm going to just, needless to say, I'm going to keep all my coach bags, okay? Bam. And then the only other thing I have is this um this carol lager lagfield book bag y'all i got this book bag from i think um tj maxx or marshall's a while ago and when i used to work in the office i would carry this bag this bag, i need to clean this bag out got a bunch of junk in it but i'm gonna keep this up to you i like this book bag this was another little and i use this bag for traveling too like to put my laptop my computer books stuff like that yeah so, needless to say she ain't getting rid of her bags let's just say that i changed my mind on the purses okay i'm gonna keep my coach bags 
I'm ready to let them go. It, it for real, for real, sis, is not a lot compared to a whole lot of women. Some women got a whole shelf, different le different le levels of just bags and shoes. So for real, for real, y'all, I think I'm doing good considering. Okay. But anyway, I think I have touched everything in this closet. From clothes to shoes. I got a good little pile over here of pieces that we are getting rid of. So I'm proud of myself for that. Y'all, this bag right here is my um Bearham Rhinum. I always say the name wrong. This is this these bags, y'all. That's what this is. Um, I have a pink one purse. Really love this purse. This is one of my favorite purses too. And then I have a smaller one in red. So, yeah. So that's what this is. But, so y'all, I really don't have a whole, whole lot. Okay. I think I'm going to put these bags over there on the shelf. But, yeah. So... That's that, y'all. I'm about to go ahead and round this video up. I thank y'all for decluttering my closet with me on today. I think I might put this one over there, too. Thank you guys for decluttering with me today. Um, and let me know if you guys enjoyed the content for today of decluttering, like I said, sis, I encourage you, please reconsider decluttering your life. Having all this extra stuff, even, you know, like everybody, I think everybody almost have a junk room. I don't want a junk room. I want a organized room, an organized life. I think I have OCD when it comes to just stuff, just everywhere, and it doesn't even, it doesn't make sense. I need for stuff that makes sense in my life. I need for everything, every level in my life. My prayer is, Lord, help me to make things make sense. As I'm leveling up in God, as I'm leveling up in all areas of my life, y'all, it has to make sense. I can, I no longer want to continue to go through life with everything is just chaotic my home my relationship with god my finances my job me as just a friend a sister a mother whatever y'all i need i just want to live a, a more minimalist lifestyle it's okay to have things but it's when we are so obsessed with stuff it's when we start holding on to junk for no reason just because oh but i really like it we really like it but we're not wearing it we're not putting it to use it has no purpose i'm over them days y'all i'm leveling up god is delivering me from clutter unnecessary shoes clothes bags whatever let it go because it does not serve me anymore I don't like it anymore. I've outgrown it. It's time to let it go. And I encourage you, sis, or even my brother, if you have anything in your wardrobe, shoes, clothes, whatever, start to put these pieces into rotation. Because if you're not going to wear it, or if we buy an outfit only for one event, then you might as well not even get that outfit. Purchase something that we can recycle, that we can continue to use over and over and over again. Because buying clothes or buying stuff just for that one time, no. We got to do better. It's time to think smarter, be more realistic in how we shop and the things that we buy. And y'all don't judge me because before I end this video, I wanted to show y'all um, two dresses that I just purchased from belts but as you can see i just got rid of some stuff so that i can add some stuff 
If you're not going to get rid of some stuff, sis, then we can't keep adding. Y'all been seeing my Timu hauls and me buying stuff and this, that, and the third. I had to go. I, I got to I gotta let some stuff go. But I wanted to show you guys these two beautiful dresses that I got from Belt. And they were they were on sale um, for like $39 at Belt. Really beautiful dresses, you guys. These are like the original price on these dresses were $119. $119, y'all, from Belts. Beautiful, nice summer dresses. Um, let me see here. Uh, again, yeah, these dresses were $119 each. They were on sale at Belts for $34.99. $34.99, sis, these dresses. And when I passed these dresses, I was like, Tammy, now you know you don't need nothing else. But y'all, look at how beautiful this dress is, y'all. It got pockets. I love the sleeves, the ruffle sleeves on this dress y'all so pretty like this is a beautiful dress i cannot wait to wear this dress look at the bottom y'all this is a beautiful dress you can dress it up you can dress it down like definitely will have this on in my um lookbook you guys so you guys can see how i dressed these dresses up so let me go ahead on and hang these pieces on up here in the closet y'all I could not resist the prices like hold up $34.99 $120 dresses girl I, I had to get it look at this one y'all I love the colors pink nice flowy y'all pockets it is thin, but I believe it has a um like a slip up under it, or maybe not. No, it doesn't. So you definitely want to make sure that you have on the proper undergarments, y'all. But this dress is so pretty. Like y'all, I told y'all I am into the long, nice, flowy, airy dresses. Very beautiful dress. Beautiful. Like pink and green, y'all. That's my colors. And it ain't got nothing to do with the Divine Nine. Absolutely not. Okay? I just like pink and green. Okay? Beautiful dress. Again, dresses were $119. And I paid $34.99 for this dress. I don't know if y'all can see it. Let me come a little closer. $34.99 for the dress. Alright. So yes, y'all. So let me see my receipt. So for this, these two dresses, I saved $169.02. $169.02, sis. I saved at belts yesterday with these two dresses. So again. You can't beat that. Okay? So, that's it, y'all. I ain't got nothing else new right now. Okay? So, again, I hope and pray that y'all enjoy my declutter. Clean with me. Clean out my closet. Organize my closet. Please give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. If you want to see more, clean with me organize with me type of videos you guys y'all let me know leave a comment below and i'll be happy to do other vlogs on just me decluttering trying to organize my life because like i said we cannot continue to live such a cluttered life you know with we can't because it's, it affects everything that we do our whole life is affected by clutter 
So we have to level up. We have to pray. Holy Spirit, I need you to help me to be better, to be more organized, to put my stuff up right. Y'all got four loads of clothes right now. I need to fold up. I hate folding up clothes. But in the name of Jesus, I'm going to learn how to enjoy folding up clothes. Because you know why? I get tired of seeing these clothes sitting in the basket. They just sitting in the basket for no reason. Why? Because I have it in my mind that I don't like folding up clothes, but it bothers me to see these baskets of clothes. It's like, how are you going to complain about something, sis, when you're part of the problem? You're, the clothes are clean. You just rather go and pick stuff out the basket. No. Fold these clothes up. Declutter some of them so you don't have so many to fold up. And then, hey, you'll be rocking and popping, girl. Like, what? But anyway, I'm going to let you guys go because I'm just rambling now. Again, if you are not subscribed to the channel, go ahead, hit the subscribe button, turn on the bell notification so that every single time we post a new video, you will be a part of the family and you'll know when we have a new video posted to the channel. Until the next time, you guys take care. Bye.